Omaha Mayor Gene Stothers says the city is ready for the storm and they will handle it better than the snow we actually got last week. They did just wrap up a news conference with other local officials. Matthew Smith just got out of that meeting. And Matthew, uh, how will it go this time? Uh, things are looking a lot better right now. The big takeaway today, more city vehicles capable of removing snow on the streets tomorrow. That's the biggest thing that I noticed. You know, the city says in previous days ahead of us that they would have a snow emergency enacted come Tuesday. But what we learned today is the specifics of those extra vehicles that are going to be on the street. So those are coming from the Parks Department, as I'm learning. And according to the mayor, that's another 30 vehicles, give or take. They say the primary goal here is to make sure that they keep the roads open whenever that's possible. Now, the mayor said she's hoping people don't need to come in. They're hoping that uh, they can have all the businesses keep the non-essential employees at home. She herself is doing that with the city. Aside from the city staff that's required to clean the roads and the people that need to man the phones, everybody is going to be staying home for the city as well. That also means libraries and community centers will be shut down. Now, the elephant in the room at this hour, will the response be better than the last time around? The city has been very vocal about changes they've been enacting since the last major snow event. So today I asked the mayor myself what they think about what could come. Safe to say it's important for you all to get out ahead of this one. I know a lot of people are paying attention. A lot of people were upset last time. You guys did your due diligence to get out in front of this, tell people changes are coming. How important is this snow event knowing that you all will be under the microscope of the public? Well, I think we're always under the microscope with the public, and we always strive to do better and to do the best job we can. I, have to, I can't give enough kudos to everybody standing here and also the Public Works Department. Those guys out there in the snow plows, they work very, very hard. And they have their, 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 their zones that they're working in, and they have the routes designated, and they do a really fantastic job. It just like we predict the snow, the mayor predicted that there's some changes in the works here. She's not just looking at the weather. She's also looking at the wind, the snow, but also that human element. That's something you just don't know. How many people could be on the roads? How will the emergencies play out? Will there be fires, et cetera? She says they have to plan for everything, and a lot of that happens on the fly. We'll have more about this story coming up tonight at 6. For now, reporting live downtown with photographer Cody Trombler, I'm Matthew Smith, WOWT 6 News. All right, Matthew. Yeah, those pictures he showed what was mm -hmm. missing was blowing wind across straight across. We'll see that tomorrow. Yes.